Anyway, here's Sally in Columbus. You've been waiting a while. I appreciate that. And how are you? Fine. How are you, Rush? Very well. Thank you very much. Thanks for taking my call. Just as a... You know, you have uh, always led us conser- conservatives through some pretty dark times. And uh, there were a few places to turn. You never let us down. You always gave us perspective and truth. So I just kind of wanted to say that. But to get to my point, um, you know, last week you were discussing Trump and the way he talked about we have to get rid of the lines around the state during the debate. Well, I have a different take on that. Um, not only did he say it that way, and you suggested it was because of his advisors that uh, were kind of, you know, doing a tutorial for him for interstate insurance commerce. And then also the thing that bothers me is that when he comments regarding his and the Democrats' touchback program, which is theoretically what it is when he says we're going to send them back and let the good ones back in, you know, Trump isn't this inarticulate. I think he does it to dumb down his speech. I think he does it to mislead and not have to give explanations. And uh, it keeps his comments kind of on the um, remedial side. And, and that's how I look at this. I know it's different from what you think, but it's how I feel. I think he's talking to a base that he doesn't have a lot of confidence in. Are you suggesting that Trump is aware or thinks that his base is sort of uh, rudimentary? Absolutely, because I think many of them are. Well, I'm using that word because they won't know what it means, so I'm safe. I'm sorry. I'm never. I'm just talking to myself there. So he's he's purposely he's purposely dumbing it down to relate to them. Absolutely. And that's a heck of a charge. Lines around the states. Are you kidding? Then he says, uh, we're going to um, send them back, and we're going to be bring the good ones back in. That's the Democrats, theoretically, the Democrats' touchback program, am I right? Well, it, yes, it is in the Gang of Aid bill. It's, it's all part of the, the E-Verify, the getting back in line, going home, and then yeah, coming back in legally, of course, with an asterisk by your name as having been here, so you move to the front of the line. It's all scam, yeah, but you're right. I've had it explained to me, no less than Senator Schumer.